So maybe the first angle is to have a straight comparison of the tokens. So on one end, we have the comp token, that is the token of the compound system. And the, on the other end, we have the land token, that is the token that is at the core of the AV uh, ecosystem. So we have a clear uh, bigger market cap for the comp token. Uh, but the comp token was launched very recently, as opposed to the AV token that was listed uh, during 2017. So it was more, more than three years, or uh, something like three years now that we have the uh, the land token that is available on different exchanges to be purchased. In terms of token rank, they are quite similar, but still the compound because of the market cap is uh, uh, is higher in terms of rank. Um, and very volatile as well, right, Anthony? It seems like it shot up and then went back down. It's quite volatile, I guess. Yeah, it was very volatile. Uh, I guess there is always a new excitement when a project mm -hmm come to big exchanges such as Coinbase, Binance, uh, other one like Poloniex. So Compound does have this, again, this backing for, from the big players. And uh, we can feel it when we look at the, uh, the way the token is uh, advertised and distributed through different exchanges. Uh, and in terms of ranking, when we look at the DeFi, Compound is definitely you know, the second biggest project. And Av is the fourth. Uh, biggest project. So really, that's that's really two projects that are not only similar in terms of product, but as we can see, they compete very tightly with each other. That's really well put, Anthony. Does the market cap make sense to you? Well, obviously, we saw on the previous slide that Compound has about three times more higher AUM than Ave, but the market cap is less than double. Uh, how do you feel about these market caps? Yeah, I mean that that. You know, that's, that's the same rational than in finance, right? Tesla is not most probably uh, the manufacturer company that does have the bigger uh, revenue or the bigger profit in terms of uh, car maker industry, but it is the most valuable company of all the car maker uh, right now. Mm -hmm. So there is always, you know, what you can price today and what you can expect uh, from the network to, uh, to produce in the future. And that's always the part of um, the valorization that is, uh, let's say, uh, unclear and that need, somehow you need to trust the market dynamic to price the token the right way. And in the sense, I, I do believe that there is plenty of, um, we will see, right, improvement that needs to be made on both uh, project and model, but I do like Ave a lot. And again, uh, I think there is always a premium in the blockchain space for projects that do have a very community-centric approach. And mm. Av definitely does have this premium. And I do not see a strong community as the, 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 the compound community as strong as the Av community.